Yeah. He emailed me last week. It was, I haven't heard from him in years. Guys, I can't take it anymore. We made $300 at the theater shoot a couple weeks ago. I mean, we didn't have to give 275 of it away for the whole gun debacle so the company wouldn't sue us. Oh yeah, oh yeah. No, wait, that's, that's only like 25 bucks. <laughs> 25 bucks. 25 whole dollars, which I loaded into my account and unloaded on the cashiers at 10 and under. Crappy arcade prizes? Oh, a mood ring? Score? Come on, those never work, man. They're fake. It's purple. Where's the car? So that means I'm gonna regret that mood ring purchase. You will hear from a long lost friend in due time. Dude, that is not a mood. Mm. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god, it's Frank. Mm. Hey guys! So I've got good news and I've got bad news. Dude, if this is about your cousin again, I, I don't really want to hear about the so cousin. Just about the cousin, guys. I don't want to hear. No, no, about. no. No, look, the good news is that I just came in possession of a thousand pounds of bananas. I am telling you guys, this diet is the new thing. Oh, I am going all in. Mm, absolutely amazing. Oh, and my car broke down. Wait, wait, did you say your car broke down? Well, well, if we do find out where he's at, I can always have my girlfriend Melissa drive him. <laughs> what, did you get to pick him up in her spaceship or something? <laughs> um, I think she just leased a red Hondo. Um, oh, wait, actually, there she is. Wait, he's for real? She's real? All right, so let me give you guys the quick rundown. I heard my mom talking to her mom on the phone, something about a charity case. I don't know. Next thing I know, I'm on a date with this fixer-upper. So, I think you guys can put the dots together. No, I don't. Hi. Hi, um, I'm Melissa. Ben's been telling me all about you guys. Oh, yes, he has. We we know so much about you and your whereabouts. Yes, and how this isn't a charity case at all. Nay, not at all. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, they're just a little shaken up right now. We got some pretty bad news that our friend's car broke down. Oh, no. You know, my uncle's actually a mechanic. I mean, he's self-taught, but he's pretty good. Oh, I taught myself how to ride a bike, but I still walk on two legs. Oh, ho, ho. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what? All right, all right. It, it was good to see you guys. Melissa, well, uh, let's head out. Um, it was nice meeting you guys. Toodaloo! Au revoir, madame! Toodaloo! Toodaloo! Till the next dawn, madame! Aye, aye! Farewell! What the hell was that? What are you trying to do to this girl? Oh, my lady! Have I ever told you about the time that I indulged in 45 different flavors of- Man, I... What was that thing about the bike? What am I even saying? Why did we do those voices? I just panicked. I don't know. I, I couldn't focus. I just could not stop thinking about her uncle. I know. She was just way more attractive than I thought she was gonna... You... Wait, you said you're thinking about her uncle? Yes, dude. I, I mean, he's self-taught. He... He's probably making millions traveling the country, pulling dough, fixing up cars, and repairing Lamborghinos. Like... That could be us, Connor. You know what? I say we start an auto shop. I think my dad has a couple tools.
Yeah, my car's broken down. And my phone's about to die. So, I need you guys to meet me down the street from Rudy Wednesdays. Guys? Hello? Balls. Ten minutes! Hey! Hey, you look like you could use some help. Uh, yeah, my, uh, my car broke down. You wouldn't happen to know anything about fixing cars, would you? Oh, no, I don't know shit about cars. But, uh, yeah, if you want to hop in, I can get you over to my hitch and we can get you up and running. Okay, yeah, um, I'll, I'll actually, I'll hop in the back, because I got, you know, I got some compadres here that need the space, so. Yeah, alright, hop on in. Come on over to Mitchell and Phillips Auto Shop. We got all the necessary tools and car parts that you'll need to fix your junk. Oh yeah, and we'll fix your car free of charge. For a specified price, when you come, come on, on over. over. Ooh, baby! Here's a list of all the services that we provide. Tire changes. Oil changes. Windshield changes. Mirror changes. Rear view mirror changes. And we can fix a bus. We can fix a bus. But wait, there's more. Not only are we gonna fix your car, we're gonna fix your hunger. We have snacks. So many good snacks at the auto shop. So we can fix your car just like we did with this one at Mitchell and Phillips Auto Shop. Hey, get away from my car! <laughs> Guys, that was pretty good. You're even using your last names. Official. Although, I don't think you needed to keep that last part in, though. See, I told you, it just doesn't work. But come on, it's so personable. You know, he loves his car so much that he's getting emotional. The we're not going to go through this again, okay? Either way, we just submitted it to a few local TV networks, and it's on TV. And we got a radio spot. Nice! Mm -hmm. So, is the shop all set up? Oh my god. I'll get the tools. Hey, relax. My mood ring is deep orange, so that means... Great. There are no predators in the immediate area. What? There are no predators in the immediate area. Okay. All right. So we have a hammer. That's a tool. Oh. Uh, whatever this is. <laughs> that That's a wrench, buddy. I know. I know what a wrench is. It's, I'm joking, right? <laughs> uh, and we have a um, just like a rubber rod, I guess. Oh, oh, Connor. 
flip it over. Second hammer. So. Nice! There's one for each of us. We're gonna need a lot more than just this. You know what? I know who to go to. Well, let's just say we made sure to feed every mouth that day. Yep, built three schools down in the valley, too. It was hard work, but that doesn't stop me. Nothing stops me. <laughs> Oh my god, is he going to hurt me? Does he want me for my goods? It's okay, calm down. I, I bet my friends are worried sick and are coming to save me right now. Where's Frank at? Rubik's doesn't matter. Look, okay, this is what we need. Car tools, car oil, car parts. You're gonna need to be a little bit more specific, please. Uh, you know, like like uh, like handheld. Um... Okay, yeah, yeah. Say no more. I got that. Hold on. So, guys working on an auto shop? Do you know us? Barely. Thanks, Rubix. Yep, no problem. Does he always have what we need? Man, I wonder what goes on in that shit. Boys, we are in business. Oh, dude, you have to thank your uncle once he gets out of prison for letting us use this place. It's perfect. I mean, I would really love to, but me serving life, so. Oh, I, I didn't know, man. Oh, no, 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 it's okay. He's a ruthless killer. Like, oh. I think this calls for a little snack operation. Those are for the customers. Let's remember that. Yeah, you're right. Well, I did bring some that are uh, just for us. Packing peanuts. Those aren't edible, you know that, right? Oh, oh, funny. Cause it looks like my mood ring says otherwise. Green, I means go. Mmm, peanuts. So are you guys Mitchell and Philip? Uh, Phillips. So you're both Philip? No, no, no. I'm I'm Anthony, and this is Connor. So who's Philip? That's Philip. And you're Mitchell? No, I'm Ben, right? Yes. No, hi. I'm Connor Mitchell, and this is Anthony Phillips. And welcome to our auto shop. Okay, so you guys can fix my car, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Whatever you need done, we got it. What's up? Well, I'm a scooper driver, and I've been putting a lot of extra miles on her, so I think it's starting to catch up, but I hear a rattling under my hood. I think it might be the heat shield on the catalytic converter, but I was wondering if you guys could take a look at that for me. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. A absolutely. Easy fix. This rattling of your hood? I mean, that's probably one of the easiest things you could have brought in here to us. <laughs> These dudes have fixed like a million meat shields. Heat shields. Uh, heat, heat shields, we know what those are. Yeah, and uh, it would probably take us about, I don't know, three hours? Three hours? The other shop told me they couldn't have it to me until tomorrow. Oh. Yeah, well, you know, if they wanted to waste so much of your time, I uh, guess we could knock that down to two hours. <laughs> are we sure about that? <laughs> Sorry, I, I guess I'm not sure about that. Uh, how does, uh... One hour sound. One hour? That's fantastic. How much would something like that cost? 
Well, um, you know, with everything going on, probably in like the five... 45 bucks? Four, 45 bucks? That is fantastic. The other shop told me between seven and eight hundred. <laughs> oh, that's... Uh, the rattling. Yeah, with the rattling and then and the, the hood. Conversation, uh, you know what? Panels. I'm sorry. It might be something more like 300 bucks. Oh, that's perfect. I'll see you guys at five. Okay. Okay, yeah. One hour. <laughs> oh, I panicked again. What did I do? Well, uh, we have an hour to, to fix this car. So let's, let's uh, crack this baby open, okay? Okay. How do I open a car? Hello. Oh, just hop to it, grease monkeys. And if you're nearby the Ruby Wednesdays on Route 70, be sure to stop at the all-new Mitchell and Phillips Auto Shop, a new local business specializing in auto repair and snacks. And a breaking story, we're getting reports that a school bus is on fire. That's right, a school bus. Man, do I love supporting local business. Hey, you mind if we stop there before we get the hitch? Yeah, sure. What's up, you punk bitch? It's my son. Oh no, I'll be home soon. Just, you know, finishing up a couple things. No, you don't need to worry about dinner. Daddy's got something real good planned. I don't know, dude. I feel like we've tried everything. Maybe you could try to turn it off and on again. I don't know. Maybe that would make the clank and go away. Like a computer. Honestly, that might work. Oh, that's perfect. All right, yeah, let's boot her back up, plug it in. Hey guys, when's my break? What do you mean, when's my break? We've been here for 10 minutes and you've just been standing there outside. Just standing there. Listen guys, section 17B of our state's labor law states that employers must give employees 15 minutes break per five consecutive hours work. This cannot be revoked for me. How did you know that? That's like verbatim. You've only been standing there for like 15 minutes. You want to break now? Oh, gee, would you look at that? My mood ring's yellow. That means I have to pee. So if you'll excuse me, I'll be taking my 15 minute break now. Okay. Just. Hand me a car wrench or something. Oh, good. We're, we're here. I'm just gonna step out for some fresh air. It's getting a little hot back. Oh, don't worry about it. I can keep the car on. AC flowing. <laughs> I got this new Coconut Breeze air freshener. Stick it up there real nice. Are the, uh, are the doors locked? You know, in my profession, you meet a lot of weird people. <laughs> oh. Snacks! Oh, oh, whoa! Splash zone! Sorry about that, I was peeing. Still am, actually. Um, because I'm on my break, so what do you want? Well, I just came here for some snacks and to support, uh, local business. You are very hydrated, son. Yeah. I drank a lot of water, ate a ton of packing peanuts. You know how it is. Go in one way, 
I'm out the other. Yep, 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 yep. I know exactly what you mean. Um, I will have some Cheezos. All right. There you go. Thanks. So, uh, what's up with this bucket of bolts? Oh, the car? Yeah, I don't know. I, I just do snacks around here. Ask those guys. Great. Thanks. No problem. Frank? Hey, hey, Frank. Frank. I have a hammer. I'm going to go get my hammer, and I'm going to get you with my hammer. Okay? Hammer! 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 Who has a hammer? I need it now. I have it. Why? I need to smash a window right now. Dude, you need to relax with the mood ring. It's gonna make you commit a crime. No, no, no. Frank is in that car. Look. Oh, great. Frank's gonna die and nobody even cares. Look, if Frank needed our help, he would just give us a call. We gotta work on the car. What do you say? I don't know. The mood ring's got him acting crazy. All right. Here, use this. Oh, yeah. Frank, look at me. Look at me. Look, it makes a little mustache. <laughs> All right, we're here. Let's uh, go get your car hooked up to the hitch. Oh, yeah, don't mind the chickens. They don't bite. I love you too. Yeah, I heard that you didn't say it. I just wanted to know what love felt like. Hello? M Melissa? Hmm. Hey, are you guys cool if Melissa comes and picks me up? I think I'm gonna head out. Benjamin! We have done nothing to fix this guy's car and he's getting back here in 20 minutes, all right? So take your stupid grub thing off, get over here, pick up a tool, and help us fix this car. All hands on deck, all right? Let's go, come on. I don't have time for this. Grab this hammer, do something with it. Yeah, we're fixing the car, yeah, we're fixing the car, yeah, we're fixing the car. Yeah, we got all the tools and we're doing the thing where we're fixing the car. Gonna fix up the engine and tighten the bolts and grease some gears. Ooh. Now we're sweaty and hot and our hands are dirty cause we worked too hard. Yeah, we fixed up the car! Well, we accomplished nothing. <laughs> yeah. We are absolutely screwed. Oh, look, another customer. Great. Oh, no, it's just that nice guy from before who said he had a car for us to look at. Oh. Give us back our friend, you whoa, kid! Whoa, whoa, whoa there. You got a lot oh. of tension building up there, buddy. Oh, yeah, there was a, a play, and it was going so well, but then the gun and the pow and... Ben, <laughs> what's going on? What was that about? Oh. Frank! Mitchell? Connor. Frank! Ben? Hi, I'm Michael. What the hell is going on? This man is going to kill me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Kill you? You think I'm gonna kill you? Oh, I'm gonna kill you all right. With kindness! But I saw your brass knuckles in the car. Oh, that little number? Oh yeah, funny story about that actually. So me and my wife have now renewed our vows four times. So uh, instead of getting four different rings, we just got one big one. Yeah, but in the car you said, Daddy's bringing home something good for dinner, and then you looked right at me. I was looking at your bananas. 
My son loves banana bread. So I got this genius idea that I could take some of your bananas, cook some up for him in my new little oven, and uh, make a delicious treat. Okay, but how about you poisoning me with that air freshener? Son, I think you've been poisoned plenty already. With all those bananas you're eating, you probably have potassium poisoning. Uh, can you get that from packing peanuts? I haven't really been feeling myself today either. Hey, guys, look, this little reveal and everything, really cute, but remember, we have a car to fix, and our customer is going to be here any second. Well, let me tell you, boys. I don't know shit about cars, but this engine is ruined forever. You guys do this? Yes, we mm. No, we did not. Well, you know what they say. Sometimes you just gotta take life's issues head on. God bless. Hey, guys. Hail and well met, sir. Well, welcome back to Mitchell and Phillips. So what do you say? Is the silver bullet ready to fly? Oh, yes, she yes, is. Of course. She's ready to fly, hit the open road, slides through the wind like a knife through hot. All right, uh, so I'll check it out then. You do that, your keen eyes. Guys, my mood ring is a brownish red, which means everything is going to be just fine. Mood, man, that's not a mood. The ring doesn't work. Dude. Well, she looks to be in good shape. Now for the moment of truth, that rattle. The ring don't fail, brother. Well, I have to say, fellas, I'm impressed. And just in time, because it looks like I just got a hit on my scooper app. So that is for you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, guys. Bon voyage! Until the morning dew sets on the mist of a new day. <laughs> Au revoir, my... I did that voice again. I know, we both did. Who is that? It's weird. It's weird. So, you guys gonna fix Frank's car now? <laughs> no, no, we are never doing this again. Shop's closed. Well, actually, my uh, mood ring says otherwise. Looks to me like we are, are just getting started. Can I see this back? Yeah. Hey! You angry? Yeah. How can you tell? Cause I feel angry. You don't need the ring, Benjamin. Oh, and can we get a ride home? We actually don't have a car anymore. You betcha. Come on, we can pack into my car. Fixing the car, yeah, we're fixing the car, yeah, we're fixing the car. Yeah, we got all the tools and we're doing the thing where we're fixing the car. Gonna fix up the engine and tighten the bolts and grease some gears. Now we're sweaty and hot and our hands are dirty cause we worked real hard. Yeah, we fixed up the car. Now one more.